In this video, I'm going to go through some more examples of multiplying matrices together. Now, these first three, you'll be able to check on your calculator, but numbers four and five, you won't be able to and need to be done by hand. So this is really an exercise of making sure you can multiply matrices by hand. Okay? So, for this first one, the way that this works is that you have the top row multiplying with the first column. Okay, so you've got 1 times 2, so I'll write it out in full. You've got the 1 times 2, so that one goes with that one, and then plus 1 times 4. And then you've got 1 times 3 plus 1 times 5. Okay, so the top row multiplies with the first column, and then the top row multiplies with the second column, and that produces your new top row. Now for the bottom row, so you've got the 1, 1 multiplying with the 2, 4, so 1 times 2 plus 1 times 4 again, and then the bottom row multiplying with the second column, 1 times 3 plus 1 times 5. Okay, so we've got 2 plus 4, so 6, 3 plus 5, so 8, 6, 8. Okay, and so that is my answer. So let's have a look at the second one. Okay, so first of all, you've got the top row multiplying with the first column, so 3 times 0 plus 2 times 2. Then you've got the top row multiplying with the second column, so 3 times 3, and 2 times 1. Then the bottom row multiplying with the first column, so 0 times 0, plus 1 times 2. Then 0, 1 times 3, 1, so 0 times 3, plus 1 times 1. So we have uh, 4, then 9 plus 2, so 11 then 2, then 1. OK, and so that's my answer. Right, so now let's try and do that without writing in that intermediate step, OK? So we've got minus 2 times 4, so minus 8, plus 5 times 2. So minus 8 plus 10 is 2. Then minus 2 times minus 1 is 2. 5 times minus 3 is minus 15. So we've got 2 take away 15, so minus 13. 7 times 4 is 28, plus 3 times 2, which is 6. So 28 plus 6 is 34. Then 7 times minus 1, so minus 7. And then 3 times minus 3 is minus 9. So we've got minus 7, take away 9, gets us down to minus 16. OK, and so that is my matrix. Right, number four. OK, so we're going into a bit of algebra now. So we've got x times y, so x, y. Then you've got 3y times x, so plus 3xy. Then you've got x times 3x, so 3x squared. And then 3y times x, so plus 3xy. Then you've got 4x times y, so 4xy. Then 2y times x, so plus 2xy. Then you've got 4x times 3x is 12x squared. And then you've got 2y plus x, so plus 2xy. So simplifying that, you've got 4xy. You've got 6xy there. And these two terms, we can't really simplify those. So 12x squared plus 2xy. OK. Right, last one. OK, so we've got uh, 3k times 2k, so 6k squared. You've then got k plus 1 times k plus 1. So that's k squared plus 2k plus 1. Right, then we've got 3k times 2 minus k. So that's 6k minus 3k squared. Then you've got k plus 1 times 5k. So 5k squared plus 5k. 
Then we've got k times 2k, so 2k squared. 1 minus k times k plus 1. Um, so uh, what are we getting there? Difference of two squares, isn't it? So 1 take away k squared. OK. Uh, then you've got the k times 2 minus k, so 2k take away k squared. And then the 1 take away k times 5k is 5k take away 5k squared. OK, so let's simplify this as far as we can. So here we've got 6k squared plus k squared, so 7k squared uh, plus 2k plus 1. Here we've got uh, 2k squared take away k squared, so just k squared plus 1. Up here we've got minus 3k squared plus 5k squared, so 2k squared uh, plus 6k plus 5k, so plus 11k. And here we've got minus k squared, well let's do the 2k plus 5k is 7k. And then we've got minus k squared take away 5k squared, so take away 6 k squared. OK? And so here is some extra practice, extra examples on multiplying uh, two by two matrices together.